Welcome back to the Mr. Excel podcast. I'm Bill Jelen. Today I have a series of numbers. At least they look like numbers, but in fact, some of these cells actually contain text. Now in Excel 2002 and newer, we get the little green indicator in the cell telling us that we have a number stored as text. And you might wonder why we care. This is going to print. It's going to look fine. What's the problem with numbers that are stored as text? If we enter a formula that directly refers to that cell, for example, E2 plus E3, we do get the right result. However, if you use a function such as sum or average that refers to a range of cells, and some of those cells are text, the text cells will be ignored and you'll have the wrong result. There are 400 plus 300 plus 200 plus 100. It only gave us 600 because two of those cells are stored as text. If you need to find all of the cells in a range that are actually text cells, use the edit, go to, and then the special dialog. The special dialog has a great variety of special cells. In this case, we want to find all of the constants that are text. So to do that, I will uncheck numbers, logicals, and errors, and click OK, and Excel will highlight all of those cells that are actually text cells. And then you can go through and fix those so that way your sums and averages will be correct. There you have it. Keep an eye out for text that are masquerading as numbers. Stop back tomorrow for another podcast from Mr. Excel.